everybody, this is Randy the Wild Horse, and I got some more of my collection stuff, which I'm sure a lot of you will think it's worthless, but I don't care. Those that are interested, I'll show them anyway. Uh, a Scooby-Doo mystery machine I uh, got at the clearance rack. Uh, I think it was like, I don't know, 75% off. Yeah, you'll, you won't see pictures like this anymore. Is that shaggy? Yeah, uh, wearing a... Hmm. Oh, it's Scooby doing a collar. Oh, that's unusual. Okay. It's open. That's what it looks like from the inside. Doesn't look too bad. Flower thing. Uh, can of General Foods International Coffees Irish Cream Cafe can. Okay. Made by Maxwell House, White Plains, New York. He also doesn't have an email address. Okay, you see that. Directions. Here's another one I got. A, a gold can of secret sore throat lozenges. Consumer division. Calgon Corporation, made in USA, and it was in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. And this is not around anymore. A Horseshoe Lake Ballroom uh, ashtray from Brower, Browerville, Minnesota. Bill in June. But the ballroom was torn down. And maybe I have the reasons. And there's the Spice Rack uh, Salt and Sugar Free Chicken and Meat Seasoning. Okay. It's in fairly nice condition and here's the old grocery tag price 99 cents at drug emporium another one here is the Bob Ross baking vanilla okay made by Sunstar Foods Incorporated Minneapolis Minnesota and here's a General Foods International coffee Italian cappuccino okay I think my dad bought this at the time the you want to be fancy in front of company or something. Okay, you see that? This is uh, my Carmex uh, for cold sores. Okay. Yep. Campho Fenique liquid uh, here. Expires is in 1986. Okay. Did I say, uh, yeah, 1986. So it's a 29 year old bottle. <laughs> Apply with caution. Original customary strong peppermints, Altoids, made in Great Britain. Sugar, gum, Arabic, oil of peppermint, gelatin, and glucose syrup. Okay. And uh, came from New York. Okay. Here's one of my Welch's uh, grape jars. And even has a website, welch's.com. Okay. So one is Dragon Tales, little music box I got here, uh, 1991, yeah, I wonder if it works. Here's Minnesota Twins baseball here. Says made in USA, made America. You don't see that anymore. Okay, and there's a little salt and pepper shaker here. Oh, it's upside down. I know my no relative of mine have been bugging me about getting glasses. I think I should. A hard time seeing here. Okay, there's this is a uh, craft calumet uh, 
Double action baking powder. There's the Native American guy on there. You won't see that from Kraft anymore. Easy open top for accurate measuring. Okay. There's the ingredients. Kraft Foods. Date in the bottom of the can. March 11th, 1999. Here's a Mary Kitchen corned beef hash from Hormel Foods. It's a salt and pepper shaker I got. It's made in Taiwan. Okay. Let's see that again. Okay. There's a Surefire Turmeric. National Retailer Own Grocers Incorporated Distributor Chicago, Illinois. Okay. And yeah, somebody marked 12 on there. It's kind of too bad. Lost the value. It's rusted. I'll keep it anyway. Here's Durkee Bay Leaves. There's directions how to make tomato bouillon. Durkee Famous Foods, SCM Corporation, Cleveland, Ohio. Okay, there we go. Okay. All right, there's I know it says here. I can read it uh, later here. Another red owl, leaf sage. This one's leaf sage. Last one was cardamom seed. Okay. This is a very old can. I'll keep it as long as I'm alive. And as soon as I'm dead, uh, I'm sure my relatives will probably send it to the garbage to hide. And even and there, you know, there's a price tag on here. Uh, oh, 19 cents. 19 cents. I'd like to see anybody buy something for 19 cents. Red All Allspice can. Red All Stores Distributors, Minneapolis, Minnesota. Ground Allspice. Here's Shelly, Assorted Food Colors and Egg Dye. Okay, Assorted Food Colors Egg Dye, green, yellow, red, and blue. Marked that way. There, there's the Zinks, they're still there. Yeah, I'll do this later. It's it's just so hard to do do this solo. I'll tell you. Oh, I'll show you what it looks like real quick. Never used. And here's a shilling Italian seasoning. My neighbor mowing the lawn outside. Okay. Cormac Company Incorporated, Baltimore, Maryland. 1979 okay okay shilling uh, oh there's there's one of jerky ground ginger net weight okay yeah jerky was for cookies pumpkin pie spice cakes okay you can go slow on that SCM jerky famous foods SCM corporation Cleveland Ohio USA Whoa! $1.77. That's what they charge for it. That was before uh, the electronic prices. They used to stamp those on. And now uh, the modern the modern method's way better, actually. So here's the shilling whole mixed pickling spice. Okay. Grocery price of two dollars and fifteen cents. Ah, back to Durkee again. Okay, Durkee Mace. Okay. Leave it all. 
Ohio, dollar forty-five. Yep. Okay, and there's Durky Paprika. SCM Durky Famous Foods, SCM Corporation, Cleveland, Ohio. Okay. There's the back of the says of Durky. It says refrigerate after opening. Oh, I guess my mom forgot to do that. <laughs> Okay, she's never refrigerated as I know of. Grocery a dollar nine. I think must have got that at that old uh, market market basket probably in Minneapolis. Who knows? My dad used to shop at market basket sometimes. McCormick ground all spice. Okay, McCormick Baltimore Maryland, nineteen seventy seven. Okay, there's a. Seventy-nine cents for that one, and here's um, a shilling rub sage, twenty-three cents. Okay, it's a little dirty, a little rusty on top. No price on the bottom. Oh, 23 cents for this one. Okay, 23 cents. Okay, now I'm trying to get rub, rub sage for 23 cents now, huh? <laughs> Here's a shilling whole oregano leaves. Oh, yeah, sometimes in those treatment things, they claim that MX uh, some pot with oregano. I think that's ridiculous, but uh, okay, I'll get back to the point. Made in 1977, okay, and oregano leaves, okay. There's how to make spaghetti sauce. And back then, there's a lot of work to that. Um, 79 cents, okay. Here's shilling chili pepper, Spanish blend. McCormick. That's when people used to cook a lot more back then than they do now. Everything's, uh, most everything nowadays is prepared food because, yeah, people just, most people hate cooking, you know, but so did my mother, but uh, my dad, you know, he always, okay, this is shilling uh, chili powder. Okay. All right. Nineteen seventy-seven, paid ninety-seven cents for this can. Okay, another shilling ground oregano. Product house McCormick. Okay, and there's a. Shilling powdered alum. Okay, my McCormick, 1975. Uh, okay. Dollar seventy seven for shilling. 